guys welcome back and this is my new video on oneplus 3t and guys you can use the same method on oneplus 3 also and uh, this video is related to oxygen os the latest uh, version of oxygen os which was released by uh, oneplus today and uh, it is based on 7.1.1 before we had the beta version of 7.1.1 but now they have released the stable version and you can see uh, they have uh, updated on their official uh, forum it says uh, these are the change logs available on this and uh, guys i'll be showing you how to install the same on your oneplus 3t i'm not able to grab oneplus 3 uh, download file once i get I, i'll upload the download link in the description below so guys i'll be showing you how to install uh, now and you can use the same method to install it on your oneplus 3 so I have downloaded the file, I will show you, this is the file oneplus 3t underscore 28, this is the uh, latest file and it is a stable version guys, before we had beta versions, now, now they have uh, released the stable version, because beta version had few bugs and which are now improved, uh, so let's see what are the things they have done, so to do that if you guys are rooted then you can download the complete file or if you guys are not rooted and if you are on beta version then you can use your VPN uh, Opera VPN to download the file uh, OTA zip but uh, as I have rooted so I have downloaded the complete zip file and I have also mentioned the download link in the description below so let's start with it first I'll boot to TWRP recovery which I have installed so after your device boots to TWRP recovery guys you can do a dirty flash also that's not an issue but i'll be doing a complete uh, factory reset and then making a clean installation so i go to wipe and do a factory reset here so after this is done i'll locate the file which i have downloaded and this is the file uh, the latest version uh, of uh, oxygen os that is based on 7.1.1 uh, and it's a stable version now so I just confirm to flash so now uh, installation process has been completed so I, now what I do I just reboot my device so after your device boots off uh, will quickly uh, complete the setup wizard so now your device is booted up and we go to settings and see as per their uh, change logs it says upgraded to android version 7.1.1 which was uh, before updated in beta version so now we we'll, this is a stable version and uh, we go to s about we check here and it is oxygen os version 4.1.0 and uh, android version 7.1.1 so this is the first change log second this is the security google security patch has been updated to 1st march and it is here uh, android security patch level that is 1st march 2017 so the next feature they say is they have added extended screenshot feature now and this uh, was disabled in previous builds so now again they have come up with the same thing so to take screen uh, extended screenshot we go to settings and we'll see uh, how to take the screenshot the extended screenshots for this guys press volume down button and uh, power button together to take a screenshot and once you do the same you will get an option on the bottom of your screen to extend the screenshot so I click this and I click here and now it is taking extended screenshot it says if you tap the screen it will stop taking the screenshot and uh, you see the screenshot has been taken and you can see that the complete settings have, are available in this screenshot so next thing what they have uh, improved on picture taking of moving objects with blur reduction so that we will be checking if I go out and uh, we'll see uh, how it works and the next is they have also improved video stability when recording these two things picture quality are related to camera I'll be testing it if I go out the so next thing what is improved they have worked on Wi-Fi connectivity yes there was an issue with Wi-Fi connectivity in the beta version uh, so let's see what uh, if they have really improved or not and they have also made uh, improvement on bluetooth connectivity and the last one is general bug fix so guys these are the change logs which uh, oneplus has updated in their forum so let's see and uh, rest i'll be able to tell you guys after uh, using it for a day or uh, two 
about the battery life and everything so if you guys are facing any issue while installation you can always drop a comment in the comment section and that's all in the video guys i hope you like the video thanks for watching have a great day